food is the ingredient that brings us together. Hello everyone, today we're going to be uh, heading to uh, Manjal uh, South Indian uh, Kitchen. They're uh, located in the corner of uh, New Vista and uh, Edmonds in uh, Burnaby, uh, British uh, Columbia. So uh, stay tuned as we go inside and uh, see the uh, inside of the restaurant as well as review their uh, dishes. The restaurant is open 7 days a week from 12pm uh, until 10pm. The restaurant just uh, recently uh, opened. Uh, they have a lot of uh, space inside. It's really beautifully uh, decorated. Uh, the name Manjal uh, means uh, turmeric uh, in uh, Indian. And as you can see, they have that uh, orange uh, uh, theme inside uh, the restaurant. They also have a divider between the two sides. Um, so they have a lot of uh, space for uh, family gatherings uh, as well as meetings. Uh, they also do catering for special events. So if you need any uh, uh, caterer, you can also reach out to them for a quote. Everything on the menu is uh, halal and uh, the restaurant also does not have uh, a bar uh, so we here we have a copy of uh, the menu and uh, that we can take a look for all the food items that they have as well as the the prices in addition they also uh, serve vegetarian options so for those who uh, adhere to a vegetarian diet they also uh, have a choice um, of food options Here we have one of their uh, specialty uh, drinks, the uh, lemon uh, tear, which has uh, lemon, ginger, mint, as well as a slice of uh, green chili. The drink is uh, really uh, flavorful as well as uh, refreshing. Our first uh, appetizer uh, dish we got the lamb uh, cola, which is uh, lamb uh, meatballs, uh, golden uh, fried. Um, it has lots of uh, exotic spices um, and uh, topped with a uh, coconut uh, sauce. Uh, the meatballs are really uh, soft and uh, delicate and yet really flavorful. It's a little bit on the spicy side, but it's not overpowering. And that uh, lemon drink sure helps to give you that uh, refreshness between each bite. Next we had the uh, cauliflower verval, which was basically the uh, cauliflower pakora. Um, it has a batter outside and it's uh, golden uh, fried, served with a side of uh, chutney. It's really, really flavorful. I'm used to having pakoras with potato and this was my first time trying the cauliflower one. Uh, but actually, um, I was sold, so I, it was really, really flavorful really soft uh, it was hard to tell that it was actually cauliflower next dish we uh, tried this beautiful platter which we were served with idli uh, it's a uh, pancake uh, which is made from fermented black uh, lentils and uh, rice it's served usually with sambar which is a spicy lentil soup we also had the, the vada which is a uh, uh, donut 
uh, made with uh, lentils as well and then it's served with uh, the two chutneys so I believe this was the tomato chutney and then we also had the coconut uh, and the last item on the platter was uh, the dosa which is made from uh, black lentils and rice it's a crepe uh, it was extremely extremely flavorful uh, and just tastes like potato chips uh, you could just have it over and over again uh, without the need of any uh, sauce the idli is a little bit more uh, on a denser uh, side it's a little bit uh, heavier uh, so it's more of uh, I guess like a heavier uh, bread um, which uh, you basically eat with the sambar or the lentil uh, soup the batter is a little bit more uh, flavorful as it has herbs and spices mixed in the batter. The outside is uh, crispy yet the inside is soft. For the dosa, it's really really crispy, really flavorful. Um, it actually was the first time that I had the dosa that actually had lots of flavor and you could just enjoy it without the need of any sauce on the side. The next item we tried was their special chicken uh, 65 uh, fried rice. This was one of my favorite uh, dishes to try. The chicken just basically melts in your mouth. It's extremely soft. Um, the rice was really, really flavorful. Lots of spices, lots of herbs. Um, and it was again topped with that coconut uh, sauce that they had on top of the lamb uh, cola. Overall, it was really, really delicious uh, dish to try. And uh, for dessert, we actually tried their uh, coconut uh, pudding, which was really, really uh, delicious. It's topped with pieces of coconut as well as uh, brown sugar, and it's torched. And on top, they put a cherry. Overall, we had a great experience. The food was amazing. The service was great. And the restaurant, uh, since it just opened recently, um, is really beautiful, nicely decorated, and extremely clean. We highly recommend you guys check it out and, and try their food. I'm pretty sure you're not going to regret it. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And we would love to hear your uh, comments. So make sure to leave that in the comment section uh, below. And don't forget to subscribe.